Australian TV host Ben Waddell just called out Zac Efron and Netflix, claiming they stole his show down to earth. Let's get into what Ben said and the legal action he's taking. Last year, Netflix premiered their show Down to Earth with Zac Efron, where Zac journeys around the world with wellness expert Darian Olean in a travel show that explores healthy, sustainable ways to live. Okay, we are traveling around the world to find some new perspectives on some very old problems. I can't believe this place exists. The show has become increasingly popular, gaining hundreds of thousands of fans on social media. Last month, Zac revealed that he and his crew are already working on filming season two of Down to Earth. But all of this comes amid allegations that Netflix and Zack stole the show idea from Australian filmmaker and TV presenter Ben Waddell. Ben took to Instagram and claimed that the show was his idea and that he had already filmed a pilot and even the trailer was similar to Zack's version. Vamos a comer. No. <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> Authentic human connections are more important now than ever before. Como se dice, let's go. Adiamo. Adia. 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 Now Ben has issued a legal notice and is demanding a response to his allegations within the next seven days. Went to Mexico, shot a pilot, called it Down to Earth. We pitched it around, but soon we found that Netflix launched one first. I said, no way, they stole my show. Our lawyer sent a letter asking why they put Zac Efron in when I just did it better. They decided to ignore us and they started season two. According to the Daily Mail, Ben never pitched his idea directly to Netflix or the production company Zach is working with, but he claims he submitted it widely in the US. After Ben's version of the show did not get picked up in the US, he claims that he began plans to shoot in Australia, but had to shut down discussions with Channel 10 after Zach's version of the show went up on Netflix. Ben went on and explained that his brother started a GoFundMe page to help fund their lawsuit against the show, which has currently raised over $12,000. My brother started a GoFundMe page to double down and sue. We spoke to radio stations, then Channel 9 chased Efron down. He was trying to hide, but guess what, mate? Australia's my hometown. We've given him a chance to speak. It's not okay to hide. Just give us the credit where credit's due. Ben concluded his video saying that his lawyers reached out to Zach's team directly, and now they have seven days to respond to figure out next steps. It's important to note Ben shared his video four days ago, so it looks like Zach's team actually has three more days to respond. In the legal notice, Ben's lawyers state that, quote, the concepts are substantially identical and added that even some of the individual shots that make up the trailer are the same. Neither Zach nor his team have responded publicly to these allegations, but fans have been responding to Ben's video in his comment section with a wide variety of reactions. Some people are saying that Zach did nothing wrong and that he doesn't own the show, he's just the face of it. And others have taken Ben's side saying that if his ID was really stolen, someone has to pay for it. Since sharing his video, Ben spoke to the Daily Mail, saying that the most upsetting part of this whole situation is that he found out season two would be filmed in his home country of Australia. He said, quote, I was sitting on my couch during lockdown and turned on Netflix and it was trending as the second biggest show in the US. I fell out of my chair. I was shocked. It was brutal, gut-wrenching. Now they're making a season two in Australia just to kick me when I'm down. Ben added that he's sad about how this situation has gone down and he's just hoping for credit and any royalties they may be entitled to. We'll keep you guys posted if we hear from either party on this matter, but Zach just posted yesterday that he's still in Australia working on season two of this show. So at the moment, it doesn't seem like he's letting Ben's claim slow down his shoot schedule for season two. For now, if you want more on Zac Efron, click right over here for another clever video. Then be sure to let me know your thoughts on this whole situation in the comments section below. I'm your host, Susan Morad. You can find me on TikTok at Susan underscore Morad. I'll catch you later. Bye, guys.